YouTube. All right. So this particular video is not exactly going to be about the usual passport stuff or some, you know, whatever. Only because my channel does have um, other interests and things that I'm interested in. And some of these I bring up so that possibly you guys can be interested in them. Now with this one, this kind of has to do with the whole shebang -a bang that's been going on with people going out in masks and, you know, um, uh, protesting and things of that nature which though i've gotten into some interesting debates with some people who weren't privy to what it's like to be of color and on the streets you know with cops and don't get me wrong our white friends out there um some of them get it too um but some of these people of privilege don't know what it's like you know down below so anyway after debating with them and whatever else, I started thinking about it. Now, mind you, I went to school for electronics, electrical engineering, technology, all that good stuff. So I know a little bit about how these things work. So one of the things I wanted to bring up is that now I'm not making this to help anybody who's doing illegal activity by any means. I'm doing this for the good people who want to remain and have the right to be a private citizen okay here are some things that i want to convey leave your phone at home okay here's the thing when they're in their process of tracking you trying to figure out who was there who was taking these you know pictures and hopefully you weren't damaging anything um, unless it was places that probably needed to be damaged. You know what I mean? Um, when your phone is on, especially, you are constantly transmitting your location. Your phone is always on in the fact that it's running and your speaker is always listening to your voice and that information is going into your phone, okay? They have access to that software. Your keywords go out and can be picked up. So when you're out and about thinking that you're just private, your phone is spying on you. It's telling them your voice, your name, your ID for your phone, where you are within five feet because those towers are all picking up whose cell phone signals were at those spots you might also think you're clever by putting a mask on okay you forget about retinal scans okay the mark of the beast if you will not to get all biblical on you but they said what well, it was on you know the mark will be on your forehead and it will be on your wrist you know meaning like your fingerprints and stuff or in this case your eye scan so you're taking these pictures like this, they can still scan this part of your face and know pretty close to who you are. They run that through their supercomputer. They know you were there. Maybe they don't have exactly all of your actions per se, because it's not a running thing, but they'll compile a list of who was there. You're taking your pictures, right? Your pictures, each picture you take, unless you have metadata off, is keeping that information inside of your picture within how many feet, where it was taken, by your phone, all that tracking information is in there. So think about those things before you go out and you're trying to be private, you know, get you like a, a standard camera that's not a camera phone if you want to do pictures and stuff like that, um, you know. Put some more makeup on put up actual you know mask on um you know like v from vendetta or something similar i know there's a lot of things that people don't think about so i've also been asked what about if i just turn my phone off you can turn your phone off um but unless the battery is 100 percent dead they can still use your phone and track you there's even technology now inside of phones that even if your phone is off, 
and dead, much like your um, credit cards, a signal can be sent, and that is enough power in the signal to power the circuit for it to then ping, and they have your information. So once again, probably wise to just leave your families at home. Don't use this information for mischievous purposes, unless it's needed. <laughs> so that's just a little FYI, guys. Uh, just leave your phones at home. Um, and if you're going to talk about any master plans of whatever you're going to do or say or go, um, power down your phones and uh, don't talk in front of them. Because if you haven't noticed yet, you can be saying keywords and things and phrases and things you want to buy or whatever else in front of your phone and then mysteriously they show up on Google um, or Amazon you're like oh I was just thinking about those things oh my gosh that's so weird it's not weird especially if you have an Android phone it's recording you know in, in those 300 page things of con agreements the contract whatever that you're reading that you don't read through you just click okay, yes, whatever, sure. Not only are you agreeing to the advertising, but you're agreeing to allow them to have access to your inf your your voice print, your information that you're saying around and near your phone. And so that's what's going on. So if you really want to, you know, screw with one of your friends when they're at a you know, at your house or at a party, get their phone and say something ridiculous like 20 or 30 times in a row, like real fast into their phone and then put it down and whatever it is will start showing up on their feed. Who ordered the midgets with, you know, nacho hats? This is weird. Why does my phone keep showing this? Um, we actually did this in many experiments and it works. So don't use this power for evil. Use it for evil. Um, so that's about it guys. Just a little FYI, stay woke. Um, enjoy the rest of your day. We'll talk to you later. Bad Wolf over and out. Then you got one more video for the week, and that's it. I try to get them out every two or three weeks. Um, the stuff I know, the stuff I can squeeze in, um, some new stuff that I can research that I kind of know a little bit about but haven't quite mastered it yet. So got a couple more um, coming soon, and then, like I said, I'm going to start launching some new uh, products and things of that nature. Otherwise, enjoy the rest of your day. Stay healthy. Don't forget to hit that bell and subscribe on the way out. Down below, check out the uh, offers for some discounts and um, enjoy the rest of your day and summer if it's not winter by the time you watch this or something weird like that. Anyway, or go somewhere nice and tropical like behind me. Maybe not right there because that looks like something poisonous probably but anyway thanks for watching thank you guys for helping me hit 1000 subscribers i'll talk to you later bad wolf over now